Hi, Robert Curry again, Innovative Air Solutions, uh, continuing our series on duct and system design. Uh, some of the other common problems that we deal with are system leaking, uh, system duct leaks at a home. Uh, a lot of technicians don't realize uh, how uh, catastrophic duct leaks are to a home, but just imagine air conditioning duct systems in a 150 degree attic during the summertime leaking air. It may not sound like if it's just a small amount of air, you can barely run your hand under the duct and you can barely feel any air coming out of it, but that is a catastrophic leak. Leaks at that point, any air that is leaked out of a home into an attic space will be made up in the conditioned space. So as an example, we take air through the return of our system, we bring it into the system and we push it out of the supply duct. Whatever air leaks out of that supply duct will be drawn in from outside. Uh, through doors, windows, light switches, light sockets, anything like that, any uh, very, very minute areas we're bringing in outside air. Now, think about it as it becomes middle of summertime, we're, we're in high 90s for temperatures, we have high humidity levels, we have high dust levels. Uh, these problems just exacerbate and it actually becomes a perpetual machine that begins to feed itself. The larger the duct leaks, the more air we leak out in the attic, the more outside air we draw in that's unconditioned, that's full of humidity, full of dirt and dust. Uh, so these type problems are really uh, catastrophic to a home. Other factors that are also included in it is clothes dryer. A clothes dryer, is, as an example, will, will exhaust 100 cubic feet of air per minute. So as long as that dryer is running, we're blowing 100 cubic feet of air per minute out of our home through mechanical ventilation, through our dryer. Our dryer exhaust is blowing hot air, hot humid air out to the outside, which we think is a good thing. And it is as long as the outside temperatures are normal or, or tolerable. Again, when it gets hot, that 100 cubic feet of air we're exhausting is actually drawn back into the home through doors, windows, and things like that. Uh, I have a uh, simple printout uh, about common air leaks. And this kind of uh, uh, illustrates our example. Uh, we have air leaks in a duct system. Every, for every cubic feet of air per minute of duct leaks we have leaking out in the attic, we're drawing in from outside. Is everything in nature tends to try to equalize. Hope this has been helpful to you today, just to kind of something to think about uh, if you run across problems of homes uh, that, that cannot seem to be cooled. Uh, you might start with a duct system if the system charges are right. If the temperature splits on the equipment are right, we'll get into these things a little bit later in, in our series. Um, but duct leaks can play a huge part uh, in, in diagnosing these problems. Thank you very much and have a great day.